Hello and welcome to the Card Exchange Solutions video tutorials. Today we're going to take a look at creating a new event and the check-in process within Card Exchange Visitor Business Edition. First we need to select the events view from the options in the bottom left. We can now see a list of all the current events and we can click on new event from the new section in the ribbon. First we need to enter a title for our new event. The default event organizer is automatically selected you can click on the button and choose a different organiser if you wish. Next we set a start date and time for the event. The default values will be the current day and the next hour available to start the event. Next we set the end date and time for the event. This defaults to one hour from the start time. We then set the earliest allowed check-in time which by default is 30 minutes before the event and the badge expiration date and time, which by default is 30 minutes after the end of the event. We can then add a description for the event. This will show up in any reports that we generate. We can then add invitees to the event, so we click on select invitees from the ribbon at the top. We can then find a visitor from the list and add them to the event, or we can add a new visitor from the option in the ribbon. Once added, the visitors will appear in the list at the bottom of the screen. We can also choose to add invitees by group. And just as for visitors, we find the desired group and select it. Next, we need to select the lobbies and the rooms for the event. First, we select the relevant building for the event. We can then select the available rooms for the event and we can then also select the available lobbies to be used for check-in for that event. Next we can select any documents that are required to be signed for visitors when they check in. There are four tabs showing at the bottom of the screen. We can see a list of the invitees for the current event. We can also see a list of the rooms added to the event, the lobbies where people can check in and any documents that have also been added to the event. When saving the event you will be asked if you wish to send an email notification to all the invitees. In the main visitor window you will now see that the visitors for the event are showing as pre-registered and available to check in. Also, if you select a visitor, you will see the event listed at the bottom of the screen. When clicking on check-in, the document will be displayed for the visitor to sign if they have a signature tablet, or you can print off the document to be signed. Once signed, you can click on finish to complete the check-in process. In the names list and on the visitor information on the right-hand side, we can now see the visitor is showing as checked in. If we now select the reports view, again using the option in the bottom left, we can view an evacuation report of all the visitors currently checked in. We can view visitor history and check-in details for each check-in for that visitor. And we can view the event invitees report to show details for that event for all the visitors when they checked in, when they checked out. Thank you for watching. You can find other videos on our website, cardexchangesolutions.com.